Probably seen help wanted signs wherever you go these days and the worker shortage is touching everyone. But Michael Tater reports businesses are hopeful after Governor DeWine announced Ohio is opting out of the extra $300 a week in federal unemployment benefits. He spoke with some area businesses and workers about this announcement and joins us live tonight. Michael. Well, that's right, Melissa. Owners, managers, and even basic workers that I spoke to at places like Bubba's 33 tell me it's not a full-on fix, but it's certainly part of the solution to getting people back to work, and they say it couldn't come at a better time. Our corporate calls it ninja hiring. That's kind of getting really aggressive and staying on every day and looking for some really good employees. Scott McDowell has been in food service for 30 years and says he's never had to search this hard for workers. It's making those he does have work longer hours. New faces every day. Like, I just train so many people, I can't even keep it straight anymore. So McDowell is optimistic the end of the extra $300 in federal unemployment benefits will help drive people back to work. You know, you need to get people back to work. If we were in an industry and we were in an area that wasn't hiring, I understand that. But if you want to drive down this street and look, everybody's got a banner. Scott Super and his wife own three diners here in the Toledo area. He says this couldn't come at a better time as more people are coming back out to eat. We're struggling even more the busier we get that we just still need more employees. It's part of the solution. Mike Vey with the Lucas County Ohio Means Job Center says this will certainly help, but so will other things like restoring the work search requirement in order to get unemployment starting May 23rd. The people have to look for jobs and apply for jobs. Um, so that'll drive some people back into the process. He adds that COVID has changed work forever. These unemployment benefits were just one piece of the puzzle. Businesses are gonna have to be flexible, a little more flexible maybe with uh, hours, with um, you know the benefits and wages they're offering, you know, different aspects of the work life balance. And now those extra federal unemployment benefits end here in Ohio on June 26th. Governor DeWine adding that will give people enough time to actually start looking for work. But those that were afraid to go back to work because of COVID, enough time to get vaccinated. Live in West Toledo tonight, Michael Tater, WTOL 11.